Hello everyone, it's Monica. Hi, with Kids Lids from my journey to a happier, healthier me on Friday, whatever. <laughs> I have to look it up now. It's 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 something. It's November 25th. There you go. Um, today was a really good day. It's Black Friday, and I hope all of my American friends had a wonderful Thanksgiving. And um, there was some really, really nice videos out there with everybody wishing it to each other. So that was really cool. I'm glad that uh, we're all in touch this way. And I hope you had some awesome food, but not too much of it. Um, I had, let me see, today a toasted um, sesame seed bagel with some vegan margarine. Turn it down, honey. And some... Um, cinnamon and brown sugar sprinkled on top so like cinnamon toast um, and then for lunch I had um, just kind of odds and sods things um, because I was on the way out shopping hi Dolly and um, so I bought myself some trail mix and I had that and then I had a banana and then I had um, a an Arnold Palmer, I believe it's called. So it was half sweet tea and half lemonade, Arizona. Um, went to the daycare that I'm working at as my placement. And um, I ring the buzzer. And the lady comes to the phone. And she's... You mean comes to the door, not comes the Comes to phone. the door, sorry, on the phone. She comes to the door on the phone. Doesn't even say anything. Okay, you have to buzz, obviously. It's a daycare to get in, right? opens the door doesn't even look at me I'm like excuse me um looking at her like hello I'm like is Angela here she's like Angela's not here I'm like okay well I'm her placement she didn't stop talking the whole time like I was like this is the place of business right all you had to do was can you hold on one second please there's somebody at the door especially when I there I'm there and I say that I'm the placement student and I'm looking for Angela, who is the supervisor. Like, anyway. So she's like, she's not here. And I'm like, okay, I have an appointment with her today. She's not here till Monday. I'm like, okay then. So can you just tell her that I was here? She's like, okay, and starts to walk away. I'm like, did you even get my name? Um, hello? And she turns around like this, yeah. I'm like, can I give you my card so that you can tell her that I was here? So I give her my card and whatever, and then she's just like, okay. I'm like, okay then. So I left. So this is my second week. Last week they were doing photos, no problem. I did get to meet her, though. And then this week she wasn't there. So I really don't know what's going on with this. So anyway, um, left there and went to um, the Eaton Center downtown. So, I left my house at about, I think, 1.30, and I got home at, like, 6. It was crazy. And I did a lot of walking, because I got off the streetcar. I took a different way so that it was a longer walk to get to the mall. I got off at Young and Gerard. Yeah, at Carlton and Gerard. And I had to walk. Carlton and Young. I'm sorry. Carlton and Young. And I had to walk probably about 20 minutes to get to where I was going. I went to Old Navy. And I got Marina some pants. They were on sale. What oh, big sale. Okay. Look at this. They were on sale. They were regular $24.94. And they were on sale for $10. So I spent. Can you see that? I spent. $40.20. $45.20. And I saved $59.76. Is that not amazing? And Marina got four really, really nice fleece heavy pants so her legs will not be cold in the morning marina wants to show this she's making a hat she's crocheting it yay yay only thing i did was i did her very first row for her and then she has done all of that on her own while i was gone hiccups did you eat too fast yeah um the dog's getting food too. He got he got a special treat tonight. Pizza crust. I went um, out and I got um, myself a salad while I was out, and it was um, from fresh 
fast fresh food. I can't remember what it's called. Freshy? I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, um, and it's this really, really cool place that you go in and it's like an open salad bar, but they fix it for you. So I got a small spring mix and I put roasted corn niblets, um, craisins, almonds, and mandarin oranges. Amazing. And I got myself a this multivitamin water lemonade and I normally don't buy these but um whatever I didn't want to get I don't drink pop anymore so that was my choice or a bottle of water and I'm not a fan of buying bottles of water I don't know if you are um only because I'm okay with my tap water I mean I know some places you're not able to drink the tap water or it upsets your tummy or whatever but I'm fine with Toronto water so if I go elsewhere like to my parents who live on well water then I definitely have to get bottled water because my tummy does not like well water um anyway so then came home and um yeah I couldn't stay downtown I was in such a panic um the whole way there there was like from from Young and Carlton walking down to the Eaton Center people were just coming at me like to the left to the right and it was just such a dizzy spell of people coming at me that I was just like overwhelmed with everything and I'm like oh my gosh I just want to go back home but I had to get the pants for her so I went and I just kept like closing my eyes as I was walking through the people because I'm not very good with like large crowds like that I get really panicky and I just I feel really like claustrophobic especially when you're standing at a light and everybody's like squished in like little sardines in a can and I'm just like go away from me so anyway I think um yeah it was weird so I went to Old Navy like I said and then I went to Urban Herbivore and got us a brownie for dessert vegan brownie and then I got my salad and then yeah see I don't like the noise crinkly. That's what I left for Kevin. So it's just about half. They're not too big, but they're only two bucks. So totally worth it. Um, and then got home and had some of the salad. And Marina's like, what's for dinner? I'm like, well, this is my dinner. But she's like, well, I'm hungry. So I said, well, do you want to order pizza? Marina's like, <laughs> so we got... Um, we got, well, I got, um, pizza with <laughs> pineapple, chicken, and barbecue sauce instead of pasta sauce. If you've never tried this, please do. It's so It's really cool. good. Pizza sauce? It gets boring. Yeah. Just ask them to put barbecue sauce instead of pizza sauce. You can do pesto sauce. You can do pizza sauce. You can do, some places do like a white bechamel sauce. But anyway, is that you with the can or the dog? Oh, it's you. Get out. So um, on my side of the pizza, we got uh, pineapple. You got. I got pineapple, broccoli, and barbecue sauce as well. But no cheese. And I'm so happy. Honest to goodness, if I wish I had like taken a film of it. It was split exactly down the middle. There wasn't even a speck of cheese on my side. Yeah. It was amazing. I was so happy because I was kind of worried about that. I'm like, what if there's a little bit on my side and then I'm not going to get that much pizza. But you know what? It was really, really fantastic. Loved it. That was my first time ordering pizza. My friend had brought me pizza. Remember I said because she's um, lactose intolerant really badly. She's allergic actually. And um, so she had gotten a pizza from Pizza Pizza with no cheese and I tried it and I was like, this is actually really good, which is why I wanted to try it today. So, then I had, um, I only had three little squares, so they're about that big. Normally, honest to gosh, I would eat, like, before, easily six squares, right, Marina? Yeah. For sure, because between the three of us, we would split a whole pizza, and that, there's 24 squares in it, and that means eight squares each, and I would usually eat, actually, no, I'm lying, I would usually eat five probably in the night and then the next day I would have three but now today I only ate three and I have 12 for myself I ate five yeah so <laughs> well so it's really good it is really good so um 
yeah I made this today this is the Kayla's that I fixed you remember the other day the eyes were way up here and Marina was having it down to here so I finally fixed it it's so cute and I put yarn in the nose to make it like plush instead of um, stuffing I don't know why but I I like doing that I did that on um, another one before and I enjoy doing that and I wanted to say I saw somebody today Marina I was on the bus going up to main station and this person gets on and she sits down and I'm looking at her and she looks at me she's like oh my god it was Aaron who used to babysit across the street oh so with Jake the dog Jack Jake whatever his Jake. name is you could go like this and he yeah fell over on the ground it was so cute but anyway I saw her and I want to say hi to her in case she's watching her name is Aaron I, I saw her on the streetcar when I was going to school one day Awesome. So she's in OCAD, which is Ontario College of the Arts. Lucky girl. So I just thought I'd make a shout out for her today. And um, who do I want to say hi to today? There's a few people who I want to say everybody. hi to. Yeah, of hi course everybody. everybody, but I try and do a shout out sometimes. So I've mentioned a lot of people's names lately, and I would like to do a shout out today to um, Trinette75. She is awesome you should watch her videos if you have not because she is so inspiring and is just lovely person her personality is awesome um, Sarah mummy of two I adore her videos she has one where she's dancing with her kids and it's just so cute and she's from England I believe please don't quote me if I'm wrong but I believe she's from England and she has this really cute accent and I just love accents um, and let me see on Monday, I'm meeting Beecher 1967. Who's that? Dale and I are getting together. And quickly, I will tell you that I saw my friend Sandra and her two girls. Now, crazy me, I don't know both of their names. I only know one is Callista, which, by the way, I adore that name and have, like, forever. Um, so I met her on Canada Day with her two girls, okay? And we're like... It seemed just like we knew each other. And she was sitting there talking to me forever. And I, she gave me her number so I could call her. And I didn't because I'm so crazy busy. Then we saw her again. No, I saw her again. Sorry. You saw her. I never saw her. No, Marina went home that day early. I saw her again at the creative festival. She was working with a friend. And I'm like, oh, my gosh, I'm so happy to see you. And I got her number again, and I still hadn't called her. <laughs> so then today I get off of the elevator at the mall and I hear, hey, and I look over and it's her and her two girls sitting there. So I come over and I'm chatting away with them. And she's like, you haven't called me. I'm like, I know. I'm sorry. So I gave her my card so that she could call me. So I wanted to say hi to them today because she's going to her friend's house. I don't remember if she said it was a relative or not, but she's house sitting and they're going to be on the computer on like a 52 inch screen. Jealous. Me am jealous. So. Yeah, it was a lovely day, and now I'm home with my dolly and a new hat. Yeah. <laughs> so I hope everybody has a lovely day, and tomorrow morning is my craft sale at the Legion. Super excited about this, and I'm doing some donations, so people are coming to pick them up tomorrow. Um, really? Yeah. I will, don't worry. Well, you didn't. Anyway. All right, everybody. <laughs> we love you. <laughs> Share your smile. <laughs> Bye, everyone.